understand. That what is to be given is to be understood that it comes without promise. It is for everyone to take what they can as and when it arises. Know that all of what comes through is merely a representation of what is the truth at present. For we all work in a manner of understanding different truths. These truths come in to manifest through different experiences that we have in our lives that come as part of who we are and where we are going. Understand that this in turn allows us to colour our experiences and indeed create what is needed in our lives at present. When we begin to allow this to come into our being we can start to realise how this has an effect on who we are and indeed how we progress throughout this. This way of being, uh, this exact representation of what is given before us. Now, you should understand that when we start to give this and when we start to give thought and allow this to come into being, this in turn allows us to appreciate what is there before us and what we have access to at all given parts and points of our existence. We are creation in manifest and we in turn allow ourselves to be that creation and to further what is and how we can start to manifest that into our reality and create what is in our selves. Now, understand that this in itself is how we can view a truth and how it is part of what is. There is uh, many aspects to what is a truth and how that can come into being into your own reality. The truth is, in fact, one set of circumstances to which you know and understand as being part of your reality. That does not mean that at any point this reality for you will change. It um, allows you to create what is and to fashion this understanding into part of your life. You can understand and adapt your understanding of a truth by simply allowing what is to come into being. When you do this you create the change necessary for you at the time. It is simply a way of allowing yourself to evolve, to expand and to create, 
to further all of what is. This in turn will allow you to give yourself what is necessary to understanding what will come into your life and how you can in fact manifest what is and this will allow you to create and further the idea of how you are working and how your life is run. When we allow this to come through it in turn creates a system in which allows you to benefit from and this is a way in which you can fashion what is and in turn allow it to become part of you. Now, look at the idea of what a truth is, and when you realize that our world, <clears throat> our universe, is in fact made up of a totality of truths, these truths can be overarching, they can be small in their demeanour, yet significant in the ramifications to an individual and how this may in fact affect one's life. Understand that through the evolution of truths, you in fact can create what is in your reality and allow it to manifest throughout the whole of consciousness. For in fact truth is a way of creating and furthering what is. Now Truth in itself is a variety of information it is understanding that truth is in fact multi-layered for it goes beyond the physical reality that we uh, except as being it flows into what is within sound and within what we see. It deepens our understanding and it goes beyond what we know in this reality, what we allow ourselves to know. Truth in itself might resonate for one person whilst seeming to be a false truth to another. It is understanding that as we are all at different parts of our path and we are indeed at different levels of understanding, this is where the idea of a truth can become A fact isn't necessarily so, for we have to understand that a fact isn't what we assume 
it is to be. It is in fact a way of which humans have created and limited their understanding of a truth. To say that something is a fact puts it at a definitive point and allows no room for growth or movement. It is simply one person's understanding at present whether or not it is accepted at a global conscious level. This is for people to understand that when you remove and allow yourself to remove your understanding of what is truth and what is fiction, you can in turn allow yourself to grow and expand your understanding of your truths. Truth is a big multifaceted word. It has many connotations for different people and it is through this that we allow ourselves to become part of the ever-growing state of humanity and in turn progress what is. Now for us to say that this is entire term limiting for what is, we would only begin to again limit ourselves and to stop this understanding of what is coming through and indeed what is our truth. Adding to the fact that this is part of who we are, to understand that truth in and, in and of itself is just a part of the what is and it is in the ever-changing moment of the present now. We must understand that as our knowledge and as our understanding grows, we grow as people and individuals and this gives us the ability to outsource our beliefs to higher consciousness. It allows us to grow and resonate at higher frequencies and vibrations to allow ourselves to in turn grow and become more of who we are and who we are meant to be. Now understand that this does not mean that this is in turn limiting, it is just a way in which we allow ourselves to manifest and in turn create and although at times our truths can seem to be sufferable and stifling, it is in fact only part of what is and it is in you to have that ability to make that shift for it is you which has the power to do this. Trust in the process of this, for this will in turn allow you to become part of your higher self and this will create links in you which will indeed allow you to grow and to indeed manifest your reality to higher and higher heights, so to speak. Now, I would like to speak about the all-encompassing aspect of what is and the growth in which you can help to create. It 
it is to be understood that through this understanding we can help to achieve more and more in different aspects within our civilizations and to allow this consciousness to grow and to create more of what is. This is this is to be understood that all of what is and all of what will be is just part of the manifestation that you are in turn creating through your idea of what is true and what is not. It is this in turn which you start to create dualities and although this is limiting it is not the end of what is. It is part of your understanding and your need to shift this paradigm and to allow yourself to see the truth of what is, to grow past that duality and in turn create more of an understanding in which you can feed the what is. However, it is to be understood that through this you create in yourself the need for understanding and this at times can create suffering and it is all part of the process of what we are and how indeed we come to grow as human beings, as spirit beings living in this human experience. Now understand that this in turn is all part of what we are practicing and achieving, uh, experiencing through this experience to help achieve more in this life. Given that this is all part of what is, then you must understand that the truth of what you understand at present is an ever-growing part of life and it is to be expanded outwards and as you further yourself along the path and keep yourself open to the idea of growth and expansion, then this truth that you understand at present will always be part of this growth and expansion. There is always more to be understood and it is only through looking at the path we are on and where we are that we can indeed allow ourselves to go forth and expand said truth. To understand that this in turn will allow you to create more in your reality and allow this to manifest within what is, is simply a way of allowing you to expand upon the principle of what you know to be true and understand at present. This for the moment would cover what is an understanding of truth at present. For the idea of truth itself is an ever-expanding conscious development. It is this in which 
we allow ourselves to grow and have an understanding at different levels for different individuals and different parts of consciousness. Thank you for listening to this message. Allow this to resonate within you and let this sit in who you are and become what you are. For it is understanding that each person's truth is a different level and understanding of the person before them and after them. Thank you. Blessings upon you all and blessings upon the planet. That is all.